There was a pastor one time, he was going out of church and he was depressed because his church was not full. And this old lady came to the pastor. He said, she said to the pastor, pastor, don't worry about it. Everything is going to be all right. It's like, mama, so and so don't understand. I'm preaching. We're doing everything we can do. And it just seems like we're not growing. The old wise woman looked at the pastor and said, pastor, don't worry about it. We're growing underground first. Because depending on how deep your roots grow would depend on how high the tree grows. And sometimes God works on your roots before he works on your fruit. Ooh, ooh-wee. And so when God works on your roots and people cannot see the root work because the root work determines the fruit work. And sometimes the root work gets a little dirty sometimes. Can I get an amen in the house? Sometimes the root work, people don't see the root work because it's undercover. They don't see you praying at night. They don't see you praying when you're driving to work on Monday morning. They don't see you crying out to God. They don't see the sacrifices that you make. That's the root work. It will always be root work before there's fruit work. So... Here is Paul saying, look at verse number four. It says, we are confident of all this because of our great trust in God through Christ. It is not that we think we are qualified to do anything on our own. Our qualification comes from God. Say that with me. Our qualification comes from who? God. Our qualification does not come from our parents. Our qualification does not come from our pastor. Our qualification does not come from our teachers and our mentors. Our qualification comes from God. It is God who qualifies us. So when somebody tries to disqualify you, they don't have the power to disqualify you because they did not qualify you in the first place. Amen? You can't vote me out because you didn't vote me in. Amen? This is, a, this is a theocracy, not a democracy. This is a theocracy, meaning that God is the one that appointed you. God is the one that qualified you. God is the one that said that you are able, that you can do whatever it is that God has called you to do. It is God that qualified you. Even when your teachers did not believe in you, God said, I know what I put in you because people look at the outside, but God knows what's on the inside. And when he sees greatness on the inside, inside. He says you are qualified. This is why sometimes you don't even think you're qualified. Because you're looking at the outside. You're looking at all your mistakes. You're looking at all your failures. You're looking at all your de- wrong decisions. But God said man looks at the outside, but God looks at the heart and it is the heart that qualifies you to be used by God. How dare you stop doing what God called you to do because somebody said that you're not qualified. I'm here to let you know today that when God qualifies you his gifts and his talents and his anointing is without repentance. 